Hi Leo, this is Dream Seer 444 here to do a reading. So Leo, excuse me if I laugh, please don't get offended you guys, but when I was <laughs> when I was getting the message here for this reading, um, I don't know, it's just certain things, downloads and things were coming to me. So let's jump into your reading Leo. Like I said, please don't get offended because I really don't know if this is you Leo that's doing this or this is something that's coming towards you whichever way i'm just going to deliver the message okay so what i'm seeing here leo there is someone who is waiting for an opportunity to come towards someone could be a feminine energy doesn't have to be but come towards someone who they are looking at as very attractive abundant this person is single this person is doing very well for themselves now, what kept standing out to me is this, with this three of wands is this person. This is like a person standing by the water and it looked like they don't even have any clothes on. They're covered up by the boat. OK, and <laughs> and they're they're looking at this woman who's abundant. You know, she has everything that she needs. She's self-sufficient. So this person is really thinking um logically thinking realistic about coming towards this person and speaking the truth about how they feel you have the king of sword and you have the ace of sword this is someone who has love for this for this um person that's sitting in this nine of pentacles and they're wanting to come for and express their love and i almost feel like they're coming to to say hey i choose to be with you with the lover's card it could be a choice or this is just about someone feeling a very deep connection to this person and wanting to come forward um, and communicate to them exactly how they're feeling. I feel also that this person may be wanting to make a light offer to them. They, they don't want this person to get away. Every time I see this page of cups, especially in this particular deck, it's like someone that's slipping away up in the air, like floating away. So I feel that someone doesn't want this single feminine energy doesn't have to be this single person to get away and so they're coming to express this love that they did not express before because this is the king of sword and the king of cups not very emotional don't really show a lot but they're wanting to come and express something okay the thing is when they come to express this love to this person and these emotions to this person the energy that i'm getting for this person is that they're going to be in like in conflict or they're going to be um, feeling a little defensive because um, they're standing and this could be you, Leo, or this could be the person that you're going towards. They're sitting as the queen of swords. OK, so this is like two people that are not on the same page, you know, could be at a distance from each other, haven't really been on the same page. And this queen of swords is in the energy of turning her back on this situation altogether and being completely bored with this conversation <laughs> um, and totally rejecting the idea of this um, connection because she already has a wish fulfillment with a new love. You have the Four of Cups, the Nine of Cups, the Ace of Cups. This particular person is going has, has no interest in this situation. Now, this may not resonate with everyone, but it was it was tickling me because what I heard was this single woman, this single person is sitting in this this nine of pentacles, self-sufficient energy. And this person is coming to them with barely anything. So then when the codependency card came out, it made me laugh because I feel that someone feels that this person only wants to come towards them to basically eat off of their tree if you look at the nine of pentacles she's abundant she has like you know coins hanging from looks like a tree or a reef or something like that so it's like someone feels that this person only wants to come in to to reap the the, the harvest of what they have worked hard for this is some type of reconciliation attempt um but someone feels that this the person who's coming in is, is playful, childish, and just only playing games and very codependent. I'm only going to give it to you how how it came to me. Please don't take this, you know, the wrong way, guys. This may not even resonate with you. But this is what I'm getting from this reading. 
and I don't know who it applies to. I don't know a Leo, <laughs> but um, yeah, it's like this person's coming with bare nothing, and they and they have not been showing emotion. Now they're coming, but they're still coming as a page of cup with you know very light um, emotions or communication. Wanting to tell, you know, express the truth about, you know, how they feel or maybe there's something more that they want to communicate. But this is the King of Swords and the Queen of Swords. You know, this is, I don't see where they're going to be on the same page. Now, for some of you, you may decide, you know, this might work out. It may come together. For, for others of you, I see someone moving away because of them having a new love and not and turning their back on the situation this could be a twin flame this is a divine counterpart okay so for some of you this is your twin flame that you are either going towards or that um you're leaving behind yes yeah, support i do this came out so someone feels that this person is only coming back for support okay but this could also be you someone leaning on their friends for advice because it says lean on your inner circle during this time. And then you have integrity. Does this situation align with your values and morals? So someone is, you know, really thinking, does this connection line up with, with my, my morals? So maybe there's something with this person returning that may not, you know, feel right for someone. Okay, so Leo, this is the reading. This is what I have for you guys. If it resonates, you guys let me know. Please don't take it anyways because I was laughing it was it's just a picture on the card with the man he looks naked and it looks like he's hiding behind a boat okay I mean whatever this thing is that he's holding in his hand <laughs> all right so I'll see you guys on the next reading thank you so much for your support and I'll see you soon <laughs>